Hey everyone, I'm Anna Delasky. Ugh, why am I here? No, I don't mean like existentially. I mean, why did I just walk into this room? Did I need something? Ugh, I can't remember. This is me practically every day. You too? You're not alone. There's a reason why you forget so quickly when you walk into a room why you actually went in there. And science is to blame. It's called the doorway effect. The idea comes from a team of researchers at Notre Dame. In their study, participants played a video game where they were asked to carry certain objects from one table to another, sometimes having to go through a door to do so. The researchers observed that immediately after entering a doorway, some participants were less likely to remember which virtual object they carried. The responses were both slower and less accurate when participants had to walk through a doorway into a new room, rather than when they walk the same distance in the same room. The doorway effect suggests there's a little bit more to your short-term memory than just paying attention. It means that some of your memory is optimized and some of it is ready to be purged once new information comes in. The door, psychologists say, is a good time to get rid of memory from the old room and walk into the new room with a clean slate. Weird, huh? I wonder if people who have one bedroom apartments have the same problem. You know what's more frustrating than entering a room and forgetting why you went there? Opening a fridge door and forgetting what you were after. Now that makes for some bad decisions. So the moral of the story is no, you don't have early onset Alzheimer's. Your brain simply likes to store information a certain way. It flushes out the unnecessary stuff to make room for important things like remembering someone's name. Well, sort of. In part two of our memory series, find out why you tend to forget somebody's name the moment you meet them. For the Council, I'm Anna Dolosky.